It's really frustrating when you have an app that constantly shows you the force stop screen whenever you try to launch it. A good thing to try to fix this issue is to clear the app's cache first. Try and see if it launches after that, and if it doesn't, clear out its data. There's a quick way to do that. A lot of people tell you to go to settings, apps, and scroll through a long list of applications to get to your app's settings screen. I would suggest going to the recents menu and holding the apps icon from there, then hit info. Some phones have their recents button as a square icon, some other phones have gestures and you can access the same screen by usually swiping up and holding for a bit. Some older Samsungs have them as two squares on top of each other. When you access the recents menu, tap and hold the app icon you want to fix. Some phones require you to hit info or an I icon or just get you straight to the settings page. Now you need to select storage and then hit clear cache. Now try to open the app and see if it works. If not, you need to hit the clear data button. Do keep in mind that clearing the data might sign you out of any account that you might have signed into from within the app itself. A common app to crash on most Samsung phones is the contacts app. To fix it, you usually clear out the contacts app's data from within the settings as shown previously, but this will remove all of your contacts from your phone. To fix this, you need to check if your contacts are fully backed up on your Google account first. To do so, go to settings, accounts, Google, and make sure that the checkbox next to contacts is checked. This will ensure that your contacts are in sync with your backup related to your Google account. You can now safely clear the contacts app's data and then launch the contacts app again. The app will automatically get your contacts back from your Google account. Enjoy!